Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this video, I will discuss the moderation analysis using a categorical moderator. We have three variables in this research work, agility as independent variable, conflict management style dependent variable, and a moderator role that has two levels, developer or tester. It moderates the relationship between this independent and dependent variable. The conceptual model here, the same moderator, it moderator M, it moderates the relationship between X and Y, and this is the statistical model. Let's go towards the S process to perform the analysis. Go to analyze, regression, process 4.1 by Andrew F. Hayes, then here CMSY is the dependent variable Y, agility is independent variable, role, this is moderator. We have, we are using model one Hayes, so I have selected this, confidence interval is kept at 95, bootstrap samples 5000, click on options, here select generate code for your visualizing interactions and only conti continuous variable that define products. Continue and then continue. So we will get over results in few seconds. We got the results. First of all, it's telling us that we have used model one, Y, X, and W. These are the independent, independent, and moderator variable. Model summary, the model explained 26.72% variation in the CMSY. And this variation has been explained by the agility and the role. Further, the model is found to be significant in predicting CMSY because the p-value is less than 0.05. Further, if we go, the agility is found to be insignificant because the p-value is greater than 0.05. Similarly, role also insignificant. However, the interaction effect of agility and the role, it means the moderating, there is a significant effect of the moderate in the relationship between agility and CMSY. Because the p-value is less than 0.05, further, there is no zero between lower confidence and upper confidence. Further, if we go, the test for the higher order unconditional interaction. This is same as this row interaction one. So we got our p-value less than 0.05 and significant. Let's check how much variation has been explained in the CMS5 by the agility only. So go to analyze, regression, linear, select CMSY as dependent variable and agility as independent variable. Click OK and we got that 9.7% variation is explained only by the agility. So it means that role is explaining a good amount of variation in the dependent variable. Now we move towards the report writing. So in this research work, the moderating effect of role type on the relationship between agility and conflict management style e has been carried out and shown graphically in figure three. Without inclusion of moderating effect, the agility multiplied by the R as I perform the simple regression analysis, the R square value of the CMSY is 0.97, that is 9.7%. This shows that 9.7% variation in the CMSY is explained by the agility only. With the inclusion of the interaction term, the R square value is, is increased to 26.72%. This shows an increase of 63.69% variation in the CMSY. Here I presented the result in a tabulated form. You can see the p-value of role and agility individually are insignificant and their moderating effect is found to be significant. So the significance of the moderating effect was analyzed and the results show that a negative because we have this beta value is negative. So it's there's a negative effect of the moderating variable. So a negative and significant moderating effect of role type on the relationship between agility and conflict management style yielding exists. The B is equal to 0.3977, it's beta, the coefficient of the regression. T is equal to minus 3.084, I pick this value from here, and P is equal to 0.0045. Now the next step is making such graphs. You can, you have two options. You can make this graph in the SPSS as well as an an Excel file that you can get from the internet. That is, you can download such files from www.jeremydawson.co.uk. However, first of all, we go towards the SPSS that how we can make such graphs. So double click on the results of the SPSS. You can see such a dotted line. 
after that select from here till data list free copy so right click copy then go to file new sorry file new syntax paste it there select the whole one and click on this button of the play so you will get the graph in few seconds you can only see such few points in the graph so in order to get the lines double click on the graph after that click on the elements and then fit line at the subgroup because i have two subgroups so after clicking i got such two lines cancel it and you got such a graph however a more attractive graph is available in the excel sheet i am using this sheet for a binary moderator so first of all i have entered their levels developer and tester after that we have to enter the regression coefficients the independent variable 0.1038 you can see from the results of the regression that a regression coefficient for the agility is 0.1038 the role is minus 1343 so again minus 1343 and the interaction time is minus 0 0.3977 so we got here minus 0 0.3977 after that now we go towards their interpretation so the interpretation is that the figure graphically depicts the nature of the moderating effect the dotted line that represents the tester category of the moderator steeps downward for the tester this shows that for testers the impact of agility on cmsy is much stronger in comparison to developers however for developers the line tend to steep slightly upward you can see this continuous line this depicts that increase in agility for developer does not change the cmsy significantly it is concluded that higher agility for the tester lead to lower the use of cmsy how i have concluded because you can see on the x-axis as the agility increases from low level to high level for the tester the value is coming down so cmsy cmsy value decreases now the last step is computation of f scale effect sizes we got effect size of 0 0.23 how we have calculated the r2 scale means the compute r square value after the inclusion of moderating term in our case we have r2 scale is 0 0.2672 and r1 scale is 0 0.097 this 0 0.097 is the r scale without moderating variable upon computation we got 0 0.23 however the small medium and large effect sizes as per the cohen are 0 0.02, 0 0.01, 0 0.15 and 0 0.35 respectively. So this shows that a medium because our effect size 0 0.23 greater than 0 0.15 but less than 0 0.35. It's a medium moderating effect that contributes significantly in explaining the conflict management style yielding. Thanks for watching the video. You can contact me on the email as well as on the WhatsApp. Bye.